Hello there, young explorers! Welcome to Twinkle Time, the podcast that brings enchanting stories straight to your ears. I'm Anne, your storyteller and guide on this journey through forests, castles, and galaxies far, far away. Each week, we'll embark on a new adventure full of brave heroes, mischievous creatures, and epic quests. Now, get comfortable whether you're snuggled up onto your favorite blanket or maybe gazing up at the stars. Close your eyes, take a deep breath, and let your imaginations go as we dive into our next enchanting tale. Unicorn and Horse by David Miles. This is Unicorn, and this is Horse. Unicorn is a unicorn, and horse is, well, not. Unicorn has a sapphire horn, a silver coat, a rainbow mane, and perfect white teeth. Horse does not. Unicorn eats pink cupcakes for every meal. Horse does not. Unicorn makes rainbows. Horse makes something else. Unicorn dances, tralala. Horse sits grumpy, blah blah blah. Unicorn prances, ha ha ha. Horse looks grumpy, paw paw paw. Unicorn makes everything cheery. Yay! Really cheery. Horse does not. Of course, all the animals love unicorn. He has a horn for squirrel to play ring toss. Bird lines her nest with his long, beautiful hair. And everyone loves sharing his cupcakes. Won't you join us, horse? Said unicorn. No, I don't like you, said horse. But what he meant was, I wish I were you. Unfortunately, not everyone who heard about unicorn was a happy or unhappy animal. A rainbow dancing unicorn who eats cupcakes for breakfast could make somewhat a lot of money. One night, while everyone was asleep, two men crept into unicorn's paddock. Quietly as they could, they tied a startled unicorn in ropes and loaded him into the back of their truck. Then they were off. The other animals awoke when they heard the truck. Hurry! They're stealing unicorn. But I can't run fast enough to catch them," said Squirrel. "Oh, I can't fly fast enough," cried Bird. "I can't run on the road," said Fox. "And, and I can't run at all," said Turtle. Only one animal could. Horse thought, and thought, and thought. Then he ran, and ran, and ran. And with six great chomps of horse's large teeth, unicorn was free. Thank you," said unicorn. You're welcome," said Horse. This is Horse, and this is Unicorn. Sometimes Horse eats cupcakes, and sometimes Unicorn eats hay. Sometimes Horse makes rainbows, and sometimes Unicorn does not. Horse likes races. Unicorn likes ring toss. But most of all, they like each other. Horse and unicorn are friends, and that's better than anything, even pink cupcakes. 
Thank you for joining us today. I hope you enjoyed our story. Until next time, may your dreams be all of wonder. Night, night.